Hey guys, we're out here at Rolog 2023. The feature is military veterans and equipment. And as you can see, we've got tanks, we've got helicopters, we've got crawlers, all kinds of military equipment here. So we're gonna take a quick walk through and look at some of the stuff that they got. I know you want popcorn. We're gonna go over here though and look at some stuff. I believe this is a Sherman tank. World War II, I believe it's a It's an international TD-24 that was rescued out of a swamp in Minnesota here. It does run, but it's got a major leak on it, so they're not gonna drive it. Here. Got Minneapolis Moline military trucks. You want popcorn in the car? Let's go. Oh, popcorn in the car. Oh, popcorn. In the car. Some military jeeps. I want the popcorn in the car. I'm gonna go check out the helicopter. Oh, popcorn in the car. Yeah, there's a helicopter. See that? A helicopter. Yeah. Helicopter. Helicopter. Yeah. Whoa. You want to take a picture by it? No. Here.
that poker and move that wood around a little bit. Okay, this is the Montana boiler. And for the first time this year, if you look way up top in the coal smoke, you'll see some whistles. That's a full scale replica of the Titanic whistles. And we've heard them blown twice already today. But I'm not sure what exactly, what time they're gonna be blown. It could be heard 11 miles away. The main whistle is 155 pounds, the secondary is 100 pounds, and the third whistle is 68 pounds.
Hey guys. Well, we're headed back home. I got what footage that I could of the 2023 Western Minnesota Steam Threshers reunion, but we had to cut it short for three reasons. Number one was the safety of our kids. Um, it's right now my truck says 101 degrees and uh, it's it's hot and it's just after a two three hours out there with your kids it's it's just too much so safety is always number one number two I'm still pretty sick I feel like I've got a dozen anchors tied to me and I'm just trying to drag them so I just my energy levels just aren't there and I do apologize for not bringing you as much film as I could but just how it worked out this year um, three I got a phone call from a co-worker we've got a major incident happening right now and I need to make myself available for my brothers and sisters that are behind the wall um, just in case because you never know what might happen so that's what we're doing child safety my health and my co-workers safety are now priority over what the show was so we saw what we could it was very very busy which I'm very happy to see especially with not only the feature being American veterans but just the show in general it's it's a very healthy outlook so I'm very happy to see that but hope you guys enjoyed what footage I could bring to you I've got a few I've got a few uh, photos for you as well, and um, that's what we got this year. So usually it's a it's a three part series that lasts a couple hours, but I don't even think we got 15 to 20 minutes of footage on this one. So, anyways, thanks for coming along, guys, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you haven't been to the Western Minnesota Steam Threshers reunion, there's no place like it on the planet. Uh, I highly recommend it. So. We'll see you guys in the next one.